Hello from the USC Newsroom. I am Mike Spa. And I am Laura. Welcome to this week's edition of the USC News. That's it from Zach about our ge ge genealogy social last Saturday. On Saturday, April 23rd, a group of Clubhouse colleagues met at the Bangor Public Library to research their family roots. The event went very well, as colleagues were able to find out information they never knew about their family roots. Many attended and learned historical facts about their family. We are looking forward to having another genealogy event, so stay tuned for more information about this, and thanks to all who attended. And here is Dolores with the Standard of the Week and why we feel it's important. The Standard of the Week is 33. The clubhouse has an independent board of directors, or as it is affiliated with the sponsoring agency, has a separate advisory board comprised of individuals uniquely positioned to provide financial, legal, le legislative, employment, development, consumer and community support, and advocacy of the so here at Unlimited Solutions Clubhouse, we are super fortunate to have a dedicated advisory board. Clubhouses are, unlike other services, provided by traditional mental health programming. Because we are a standards-based recovery program that is so radical from um, traditional treatment programs, the relationship with our hospice agency is also quite different. And for a clubhouse to be successful, a dedicated, knowledgeable, and effective advisory board is essential. That Saturday, we'll be meeting at G Forces Adventures in the Bangor Mall from 10 to, 10 to noon. G Force offers X, throwing, laser tag, and arcade games. Please budget your time and money accordingly for the activities you, you would like to participate in. Here is Crystal with the quote of the week. The quote of the week. All our views can come true if we courage to pursue them. Walt Disney. This month is Mental Health Awareness Month. We will be focusing our social media presence and some news segments on mental health. Please stay tuned. This week will be focused on mental health and education. Last Thursday, we attended the career fair at the Bangor Mall. Here is Jasmine with a quick update update on what went on. Hello. On Thursday, the 21st, there was a job fair at the Bangor Mall. Folks from the local area were welcome to gather Tuesday afternoon for this event. There was a great turnout, and folks were able to choose from a variety of different fields. We will keep you updated on any future job fairs. Stay tuned. Some exciting new jobs in the area are at Waterfront Concerts. They have a variety of opportunities and a job fair coming up on May 21st. Speaking of Waterfront Concerts, the clubhouse will be your number one location for concert parking this year. We can't wait for the season to start the season again. Here are Heather and Roger with a mom joke in honor of Mother's Day coming up. Don't forget your mom next Sunday. Roger, mm -hmm. why is the computer so smart? I don't know why. Because it listens to its motherboard. <laughs> <laughs> that's the week. That's the week in news for the first week in May. What you gonna do when Hulkamania will require on you? <laughs> <laughs>